Hey guys, thank you for clicking on my channel, Leonora Loves Nursing. And I want to talk to you guys about how I deal with difficult doctors. If you guys are interested, stay tuned. So, working as a nurse, I have dealt with some amazing physicians. Like, amazing. I mean, they're very respectful, very professional, treat you like a human being. And on the flip side, I've dealt with some disgusting, nasty doctors. Okay, there's no other way to put it. And the way that I deal with it, the first thing is I really ignore them, honestly, because there was a situation not too long ago where it was like change of shift, and during change of shift, nurses are all on the computer. I mean, doctors also have to respect nurses. Like, you're coming in at 7.30 you know 745 this is the time that all the nurses need to be on a computer so that we can you know give report and you know check the computer for any conflicting information or whatever the situation is doctors should understand that okay that's the same thing for like 645 7 in the morning and 645 to 7 o'clock or 730 in the evening I mean that's the time that nurses that's the time that we change shifts usually um, in the hospitals 12 hour shifts so there was a situation at night, it was like 7.30, and this doctor came storming in and he was like, I need a computer, someone needs to get off the computer right now. I looked at the doctor like, and I kept on typing away because one, you don't even talk to a dog like that. Okay, two, that is very extremely disrespectful and I have zero tolerance for unprofessionalism. Okay, now if the doctor came to me and said, you know, I'm really busy, guys. Is there any way that someone can give me the computer? Please, I just need to put... You, you don't even need to give me an explanation. Just be respectful. I would have gladly gotten up, taken my bag, and try to find somewhere else or go on a patient room to use the computer or something like that. But no, I will not acknowledge anyone who's being disrespectful to me, regardless if you are a physician or not. That's just unacceptable. So, let me tell you how it planned out. So, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so, um, the guy, he's like, I need someone to use a computer right now. And he came in the same office that I was in. And I was like, um, I didn't, you know, I ignored him. And I was continuing to do what I was doing. And the nurse behind me, he was like, okay. And she was like, oh, okay, doctor, you know, all right, let me move. And I looked at her and I'm like, in my head, you are so foolish because you don't let anybody talk to you like that. I was not getting up out of my seat. I was not getting up out of my chair for nobody who's going to speak to me worse than the animal. So anyways, so me and him are in the office together and I pay him no mind. I totally ignore him and I'm, you know, doing my, you know, finalizing my last notes and everything like that. And I am um, totally ignoring him and he's just, you know, so frustrated over God knows what, you know what I mean? On the, on the other side and I'm just like totally ignoring him. So he, um, once, once he's done, he feels so bad. Like you can tell in his face that, you know, he just acted a complete fool, you know? And then he's just like, oh, thank you everyone. And he just goes off. Now, how you really deal with, how you really deal with difficult doctors, if the way that I do it, I just ignore them. You know, as long as you don't, you don't, you know, it hasn't gotten so bad that I have to go to higher administration or higher, you know, the higher level of um, administration. It hasn't been that bad, but usually when doctors are snotty, I just ignore them because as long as you're not, you know, being disrespectful to me, you're not cursing at me, you're not doing anything, totally ignore them. Okay, when you're all ready to speak to me like an adult and a professional, then I will answer you. There are so many times that I've ignored people. There are so many times that I've ignored physicians because they are nasty. Not all of them, but some of them. I totally ignore them. They're like, oh, hey, you, da da da. Who is hey, you? I have a name. My name is Leonora. And now, if you want to speak to me, you're going to acknowledge me like a professional. Totally ignore them. I hear them. But I'm not looking at them until they acknowledge me like a professional. So, guys, if you ha if you have some doctors that are very rude, you know, I ignore them unless it's just to the point that they they're saying some really disrespectful things. And of course, don't be afraid. 
don't be afraid to confront them in a private area and explain to them that you know they don't appreciate the thing that they're saying and if they're still not trying to hear you go to your boss go to your nurse manager go to the medical director go to the nursing supervisor go to whoever you have to go to in order to get respect in your workplace because no one deserves to be sp spoken to like an animal so i want to know how you guys deal with difficult doctors uh send me an email leonorelisnursing at gmail.com um send me a comment write down comments of how do you um deal with difficult doctors or send me a YouTube inbox. And until next time, guys, I will talk to you later. Bye.